music creeps me out. A lot. A syringe filled with a blue liquid. Okay. A report of a Tismuid tribe. The Tismuid... The Tismuid was an Aboriginal tribe discovered in the late 15th century on the island west of Canada. They engaged mainly in fishing. It is particularly striking that unlike other Aboriginal tribes of the time, the Tismuid carried out sacrifice, sacrificial rituals similar to those of the Mayans or Aztecs. According to the first explorer sent by John Cablet, the locals sacrificed two brothers, twins, to offer their blood to the underground god who, according to legend, would be reborn and bring duality back to the world. I really hope that they are just all completely wrong about this. I'm very scared of what I have to might fight. That is awesome. Hey, this music can get fucked, honestly. Is there nothing else? Leave it. Damn it. Okay, so I have an idea what we have to do with this syringe. So I have an idea what we might have to do with the syringe and that is maybe injecting it to like us. In the memory. This is actually the only thing I can think of right now. I remember how it has been said in one of the diary entries that I think um, the father of the twins, so our father basically, injected the antidote into us, but I'm not sure. So I will go back to the Can I have some music, please? Thanks. I will go back to the meeting room. Go back into the memory and see if we can do anything in there with the antidote. And we still need a, a second eye or something. But that's really just the only idea I have right now. So, let's go back.
mean, I can't combine it with anything here, right? Yeah. Do we have to inject it into the eye? Should we try that? I mean, I don't know why we would do this. But there were a couple of things here that I don't really understand why we did them. Like, I know why we did them, but the um, when you think about the a real-life reason, then I, I sometimes am not sure what why we did this. Okay, back to the main hall. Ah, uh, no, wait. Um, back to the office. I assume the floating guy is around. I mean, maybe we need to use the antidote because we have been... Ugh, no, I don't know. I thought he injected the antidote into us, but maybe he injected the blood into us and now we need the... Always waiting for the music. Ah, oh, Mensch. I don't know why this is so confusing to me. So that the music can tell me if the floating fat dude is around. So wrong again. Ah, ich krieg die Krise. I will never remember that part. Because she's so heavily injured. Why can we not look into this? I could place something in front of the scanner. How about your eye? You have one. would we find another eye? I don't get it. I also I'm pretty sure that we were running out of like rooms to to look at since we we've done almost all of it. Was the water okay? Shall we go back to the room where we could save? And see if anything happened there? So 
something we could pick up? Emma, don't come to the vault. Save yourself from hell. It's a warning for Emma, one of the missing tw It may be possible that one of the girls is inside the vault. I must find- Yeah, we already did. I also don't think that there's anything in this room anymore, which is our bedroom. And I also don't think we have to cut out another eye, because otherwise we're blind. And I don't think that's helping. to use the antidote on something but I don't know on what I mean we could try Try the guy in the memory in the dentist room, but I doubt it. There's another dead person, but that will have, the whole face was missing. In the other memory, or we could. See if in the first memory the first memory where we found um, the, the child. If there's anything there. Checked out. Oh, no. Oh, ah, yeah. Okay. We know this. Who else could we inject the, the antidote? Okay. Entries 
So he actually said that he was hitting us over the head. I will proceed to administer Maria with the antidote. I will proceed to administer Maria with the antidote. Do we have any hint or anything? I've injected Maria. Okay, so he has injected Maria with the antidote. At first, her body began convulsing and she released a deafening shriek. Someone broke into the mansion, a young and reckless woman. I do not know what brought her here, nor do I care. I hit her over the head with a lead pipe, which I admit was unwise. I ha had I hit her much harder, she would not have survived, and a potential test subject would have been wasted. She is now unconscious with assisted ventilation. Once she has stabilized, I will inject her with Maria's blood. I'm close to finding the cure. Wait for me, Maria, just a little longer. So he injected her. I mean, did he? I finally created an antidote that works. It eliminates sickness in just a few seconds and the subject returns to its natural state. Due to the damage inflicted on the body because of the sickness, however, the subject will inevitably die of multi-system multi failure after the mimeomilments. See, this is what I meant. I will test the antidote for at least for the last time on a subject I have been keeping in the restroom on assisted ventilation. First, I must inject her Maria's with Maria's blood and wait for the sickness to spread. I must have patience. I have waited so long for this. I can wait a little longer. So we have Maria's blood ingested. But do we show any signs of sickness? Not really, right? So I thought that we can just use it on us, like we use all the other... Can we do anything with it here? What test subject? What do we have to do with this? I don't... I don't know. we go back because we already have Maria's blood in us but then we can use the antidote but apparently that's not the case so I really don't know what we have to do
not so. Like, I, I wonder why we cannot use ourselves on the vault door. This is puzzling me. And I'm also wondering, is it supposed to be like this? Because I think we did everything so far. So why... Why can we not do this? Why does it say something can be placed here? I mean, I know, and that's that's gonna be our own eye. Like, our face. We just put our face in there. Because I honestly do not know what else we we could do here. And um, and maybe we don't even have to use the antidote now. I think it's the antidote. Even though it says it's a blue liquid, but I'm pretty sure it's the antidote. What else would it be? Music, please. I can't believe how often that gets me. Because it looks so similar to when we go through here and then come out the other end. Do we have to, I don't know, do we have to unequip a weapon or... It's still not... I... How is that so difficult? here and then this okay we read that this scanner is ready okay I don't understand it. I don't get it. It doesn't make any sense to me either. Like, what if we unequip? <gasps> really? Oh, fuck off. Okay, I call bullshit. Oh god. close behind us. Oh god, that scared me. Is that the father? Is the father Noah? Incredibly. Grandfather Noah? Yeah, see? Now I remember you. Oh, God. You have your memories back. 
Then you remember that your stupid mother stopped me from sacrificing you and your sister. Well, thank God. A sacrifice that could have brought back our savior. Well, God took care of her. He made her pay for her sins. This is all your fault. Did you kill my father too? The radiation that comes from the sacred placenta is extremely harmful to us, impure and worthless beings. The sacred placenta? Really? For years, Bertram and his son William after him tried to find a cure for the effects of radiation. Today, William succeeded. With this accomplished, I have no use for him anymore. May God welcome him into his realm. So he... he poisoned her. You will pay for this, Noah. What have you done to my sister? Where is she? Your sister is just another tool for me to awaken our savior. Follow me if you want your answers. Hey, wait! Where do you think you're going? just said it. He said it in an extremely creepy way, I admit. As soon to keep out radiation, I can feel someone staring at me from the inside. Ooh. Okay, so we miss a couple of entrances from Bert Bertram, Bertram's diary. September 15th, 1980, Maria has escaped with the girls. I will stay at the temple, blocking the door from the inside to keep the cult members locked in for as long as possible. Seven bullets will not protect me for long, but I will try to make each one count. We have less. William, I do not ask you to forgive me. I do not deserve it, but if one of these letters make it to you, I want you to know that I am sorry. From the bottom of my rotten soul, I am sorry for everything. Oh God. 